Opposition candidate seeks president and Gagwa's removal, ZDF disbandment and delayed elections. Little known complete knockdown of establishment, CKD, party leader, Gastav Kavu has approached the High Court, seeking several court orders among them, an extension of the election date, the disbandment of the Zimbabwe Defence Forces, ZDF, and another compelling both the state and private media to give equal coverage to all political parties contesting in this year's general elections. Kate Vu filed his urgent High Court application yesterday, citing the Zimbabwe Electoral Commission ZK, and the ZDF as co-respondents, adding the country's constitution was usurped in November last year when President Emerson Ngagwa assumed power with the backing of the military. Ngagwa, having ascended to the presidency of Zimbabwe on the basis of military events, movements or deployments and not by popular vote, lacks the mandate or authority to call for elections and or perform the electoral duties of a president as dictated by the constitution relating to the role of president in elections, he said. And as such, the office of the president of Zimbabwe is vacant and needless for this application to request the court to nullify the presidency of Ngagwa for the reason that was given on November 24, 2017 and his occupation of the president's office is of no consequence. There is a power vacuum in the country, which must be addressed by all-inclusive transitional authority with the mandate or authority to run the country, restructure the first respondent, and, thereafter, at an agreeable date, call for elections or invite the United Nations UN, to administer elections for Zimbabwe. Kate Vu also challenged its chairperson, Priscilla Chigumba's appointment, arguing that the appointing authority, and Gagwa, was not properly in office. There is indisputable link or affiliation of the ZDF to ZANU PF party, which originated from the liberation struggle, which must be annulled by the second respondent, ZDF, for the reason that ZDF is a national army and not a ZANU PF party's political militia. And if the ZDF cannot be delinked or de-affiliated from ZANU-PF party, then the current politically biased ZDF must be demobilized or disbanded to pave way for a new and neutral ZDF without any political bias, which shall be made to swear to defend all political movements in the country as part and parcel of Zimbabwe, the presidential candidate said. Kate Vu further said basing on the biometric voter registration statistics that were provided by SC, ZANU PF had an electoral advantage and was more likely to win this year's elections, owing to unequal and unfair voter registration patterns. The matter is yet to be set down for hearing.